Every day, American justice is delivered in hearings that look just like this. In the dock, a disproportionately high number of young black men. New analysis of the U.S. prison population finds more black men are incarcerated now than were enslaved in 1850. Uh, the difference is they did not have the kinds of support structures, the second chances, the resources uh, that would allow them to survive those mistakes. You wake up in the morning stumbling. Wake up in the morning wondering how you're gonna get For one, I don't know how you change someone's heart. Like, even for myself, me being someone that got out of that situation, morning, you need a heart to want to go change that. Vegan, how did I get this far from home? How did I get parents like that, you know? I beat myself up. Like I was the one doing it. My daddy called me. Hey, I'm coming to get you, and don't come. They used to eat me up. You just want to lay back down. This problem is huge. I mean, there's not one person that I know that's African American that doesn't have a relative in jail or on drugs. We see uh, young kids. Uh, that experiment with drugs and they get caught. So what do we do? Do we ruin that person's life forever and label them a felon uh, or uh, an ex-inmate? Uh, or do we get that person's attention, punish them, but make sure that, you know, if they're going through college, they're being successful, then it's highly, a high likelihood that they will be successful people.